Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Ve salatu ve selamu ala nebiyyina Muhammedin Ve ala alihi ve sahbihi ecmain Amma ba'd Fe'auzu billahi mineşşeytanirracim Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Rabbi İşrah li sadri Ve yassir li amri وَحْلُوا لُقِدَتَمْ مِنْ لِسَانِ يَفْقَهُ قَوْلِ رَبِّي زِدْنِ عِلْمًا حَجْمَئِنْ اِنْشَاءَلَهُ May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge. As-salamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to this session. This is session two for the Surah Surat al-Shams. We did session verse one last time. We'll do session two today. It is really a fascinating surah. Incredibly fascinating surah. In fact, all surahs are fascinating. But sometimes when we study deeply as we are doing now, then the guidance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala touches our heart. It touches the core of our heart and we feel the miracle of Allah, which is the Quran, which we are trying to understand through the help of learning the language of the Quran through Madina books. Yeah. Madina books written by Dr. Abdul Rahim has opened the door for us. Alhamdulillah, very, very fortunate. May Allah bless Dr. Abdul Rahim and his family in both the worlds. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. So we are starting from here. Verse number eight. Very fascinating, very fascinating. People can read this memorize it, but they will not touch to the core of the essence of what Allah is trying to guide us to, which we are attempting to do it in this class, inshallah. And Allah will make it easy for me to explain you and for you to understand it. And then you will Keep it in your mind, and every time you read it, everything will come back to you, inshallah. So that is my hope and prayer. So we are starting from here. So Alhama, ha, Alhama. This is form four. Alhama ha, fujura ha, wa takwa ha. فَأَلْحَمَهَا فُجُورَهَا وَتَقْوَاهَا See, I'm trying to make it as interesting as it is possible with the whatever knowledge and capacity Allah has blessed me with. My job is to make it easy, interesting, so that you will love it, inshallah. So this is a very special verb. It has come only once in the Quran. Huh? Once in the Quran. Alhama, Form 4. Look at it. It is doubly transitive. Huh? It is doubly transitive, which means it will have two mafunun bihis. I am explaining you everything, giving you all the hints, you know. Inshallah, when the recording comes tonight, you can read it again and it, it will refresh your mind. Abdullah Yusuf Ali and its enlightenment, enlightenment of our nafs huh? and its enlightenment as to its wrong and its right. Yes, this is very important to understand. That Alhama means Allah is 
enlightenment, enlightening our heart to its wrong and right. Dr. Morali, then he enlightened, that is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So when I write Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, I write it in capital. You must have noticed it. Huh? We want to write the pronoun of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in capital. Huh? Then he enlightened it of its immorality. Huh? Yes, immorality and its righteousness. Yeah, two things, remember. Right, wrong and right, immorality and righteousness. And then we, clear Quran says, and then with the knowledge of right and wrong, inspired it. Allah inspired our nafs, our self, you know. Fine. <clears throat> so I have here given you Alhama ha, mafulun bi number one, fujura, mafulun bi number two. See, alhama is form four, so the verb comes as a mafulun bi, and then it fujura also becomes mafulun bi number two for alhama. Mafulun bi number one, mafulun bi number two. So fujura ha. Ha has to be mudafilihi. But taqwa ha, yeah, two things. Taqwa is the righteousness. Huh? Righteousness. Fujura is immorality. Immorality. So we come here now more. What is the meaning of alhama? Fa is harfu atfin. Alhama, double transitive, I said. To instill something into, to inspire something. To influence, move, or guide by divine or supernatural inspiration. That is the meaning of alhama. Huh? Two things. To instill something into, inspire, to influence, move, or guide by divine or supernatural inspiration. So now we will <clears throat> go further deep. Fa alfawu harfu atfin alhama, as I said, form four. Alhama fielu madin mabdin ala fata. Thus we can understand. Now the question is, where is the file? File, damirul mustatirun taqdiru huwa. And who's that huwa? Al-Mawla Ta'ala. This I get from Fakhruddin Kababa. Al-Mawla Ta'ala. Allah is the file. He inspired. He guides. Well, jumlatu min fiyal wa file. La mahal laha min al-Arab. Mautufatun ala jumlatu sava that came before huh? sava. Waha alhamaha damirun mutasilun yaudu ala nafs, our nafs. Yaudu ala nafs. Mabnin ala sukun fi mali nasbin mafurun bi number one. If you say mafurun bi awal, then there has to be number two also. So I wrote down here my fulun B number one. Fujura, yeah. Fujura is your my fulun B number two. My fulun B sani. Huh? I wrote side by side. My fulun B number one. My fulun B number two. What is Fujura? Huh? To act. Immorally, immorally, immorality, immorality, adultery, yeah? wickedness, you can, to be unchaste, you know, I like to say unchaste, no morals, yeah? or you can say lewdness, lewdness, 
And then we got this done. Okay, no, we didn't get fully done. Then Fujura is Mafun bi Sani. Mansubun, yes, I can see it is Mansub. Walamatun Naspe, Fatah, you can I can see that also. But who are Mudaf? And then Ha is Mudafilehi. Mudaf, Mudafilehi. But Takwaha, this is the second thing. Fujuraha, what Takwaha? Takwa is a verbal noun. From ittaka, yattaki, muttakin, then takwa is the verbal noun. What is the meaning of takwa? God consciousness, yes. Immorality, opposite that, God consciousness, godliness, devoutness, piety, righteousness, fear of Allah, his pleasure. I write down, whenever we say fear of Allah, I want to write down fear of his displeasure. Yes, I am afraid of only one thing in the world, and that is the displeasure of Allah. I don't want to do anything, not, neither you should do anything huh, which will displease Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That is our main aim, huh, that we are doing everything that Allah will be happy with us. I have said many things to you, but not today. You know, a lot of uh, poetry and that I, I said it in the past, you know. Fine. So taqwa I told you. Now you have to understand one thing that also I explained in the last thing. See the spelling, huh? Takwa, ha. That ya change into alif. That will always happen when there is a pronoun attached. Then you will have to write it like this. Huh? Remember? Takwa, ha is written like this. Because when something ends with ya and va, then we have to write like that. Okay. Al va harfu atifin. Al va atifatun harfun mabnun ala fata wa taqwa ismun mautufun ala fujura mansubun. Yes, it's mansub. Alamatu Naspi Fata Alamatu Naspi Fata Wahua Mudaf Eha Damirun Mutasilun Mabnirala Sukun Fimali Rafin Mudafilehi. So Mudaf Mudafilehi. Now, further explanation Fujuraha Fiskaha. What is the meaning of fiskaha? Lewdness, sexually unchaste, debauchery, corrupt. What taqwa? Okay, against that is taqwa. Fujura and then taqwa. Righteousness, honesty, piety, salaha. Salaha. Is the this is all righteousness, honesty, piety, and doing everything good. See, form two means somebody is aware, somebody is well acquainted. So, who's that file of Arrafa? Subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah is very well aware. We must all understand this. Huh? Allah is very well aware. A nafsa of our nafs. Okay? He is very well aware of our nafs. For Afahamaha, he understands hal fujuri wa taqwa. The situation or the condition of 
lewdness and piety. Rama fi hima mean kubhi wal husni. All these are adjectives for fujura, ugliness, repulsiveness, fujur, uh, and husnu is goodness. Uh, now I write down on my own. This is the situation of our nafs that Allah has put two things in us. We have a choice to do good or to do evil. Choice is our. Human beings, all human beings, Allah has given this choice. Nobody is forced to do anything. Choice is ours. What do we want to follow? Do we want to follow piety or wickedness? Do we want to follow righteousness or we want to follow lewdness? Unchest. What do you want to follow? So I wrote down here in my own way. Now the choice, choice is ours. Which way we wish to turn? Which way you want to turn? Okay. Alhamdulillah. Very fascinating. Huh? Never, we can never understand that. All of us have this choice enough in us, all of us. Now, verse number nine, Abdullah Yusuf Ali. Truly, he succeeds that purifies it. Yes. Between two of these choices, kad aflaha means he succeeds, man zakkaha. Whosoever purifies it, his self. Huh? Dr. Morali, successful indeed will be he who purifies it, his nafs, you know. Kilar Quran, successful indeed is the one who purifies their souls, yeah. Our souls, and when we say nafs, that is our souls. Abdullah Yusuf Ali, truly, he succeeds that purifies it, that is, goes to the soul. Kad huh? afla. So, kad means rubbama, possibly, perhaps, or they also write indeed. Huh? All meaning are there, kad. Harfu tahkik, babunilala sukun. Afla, form four. Aflaha yuflihu. He succeeded, became successful, he prospered. Aflaha fielun madin mabnun ala fata. Aflaha man, man, man, man. I wrote down man and then I am writing Allahji, which is Allahji. See now, on our own, we may not understand deeply as we are trying to understand now. With the mercy and grace of Allah, the scholars provide us beautiful things. This is Suleiman Yakut, and we have Fakhruddin Kababa, and we have got many other scholars who, Dr. Mohar Ali, they all provide us beautiful things, you know. So I try to break it down into small, squares or triangles, you know, man, ismu mausula, ismun mausulun, bimana allazi. So I write down, it means allazi. Mabnun ala sukun. Even there is a sukun here also. Female rafin file. The file for afla, who is successful? Afla is the man. Man is successful. Allazi is successful. File. Huh? Okay. But Jumilatu min la mahal laha min al Arab. Al Jumilatu min la mahal laha min al Arab. Jawabu kasam. Yes. Huh? This is Jawabu kasam. Jumla. This Jumla is Jawabu kasam. Allazi 
في بداية سورة الكريم in the very beginning uh, uh, it came the kasam came uh, jawab kasam wa shamsi wa duha so it all goes back to the shamsi that was the kasam and jawab kasam is coming now remember it came in uh, yeah i think we bidaya to karima Suratul Karimati, yes, Bidai. But Jumlatu, Uslubul Kasmi, La Mahal Laha Min Al Arab, Ibtidai Yatu. This is first introductory, initial, beginning, opening, Bidayati. Jumlatu, Uslubi. Then the mode of method, mode or method or style of Kasam. That is all the style of the Kasam, you know. Job fine. Kadafla man zaka. So then man was a file. So we have a zaka here. Zaka purifies to purify. Dr. Morali, from what kind of a problem we want to purify? From the filth of polytheism. Polytheism, too many gods. Even money becomes our god. Our house becomes our god. So these are all polytheism. Morally, from the filth of polytheism, he purified zakka, he cleansed, huh? fine. Zakkaha, again, same way. Do you see how it is written here? Here, I wrote here also. See, spelling change. This is zakka, and the ha comes, it's written together like this, you know. Zakka, form two. Zakka yu zakki, fielu madin, mabdun ala fata, fata til mukaddari. Yeah. See, the fata is mukaddara. It's not written. But our mind can see it, our eyes cannot see it. So we have two kinds of eyes in, our, on, in front of our face and also in our mind. There are eyes. Who understand it, you know. So that is why it is Mukaddara. It is Mukaddara. So I write down like that. I put a Fata Mukaddara here. Huh? This is only for your understanding. It's not in the books or anywhere else, just for you to understand. Tahazuri. Tazuri means difficulty, impracticality, not possible to put Dhamma Fata Kasra on any noun or verb which ends in vow or yal. Zaha has to be mafun and bihi, hopefully. No, but before we go anywhere else, we have to say, where is the file? The failun, damirun, mustatirun, jawazan, Jawazan means, you know, possibility. Takdiru huwa, and that goes to man. That goes to the man, the file. Okay? And then, shumilatu, min fiel wa file, la mehel laha min lairab, silatul mausul, yes. That's not too difficult. Man came, alazi, so this became silatul mausul. That's good enough. Waha, Damirun, Mutasilun, Mabdun Allah Sukun, Fimali, Nasbin, Mafulun, Bihi. That is also not difficult. So there is one here on one hand, Kad Aflaha, Man Zakaha, and then opposite to it, Kad Khaba, Man Dasaha, opposite of this sentence. Abdullah Yusuf Ali, and he who fails, 
that he who feels that corrupts it, yeah. He feels that corrupts its nafs, that corrupts its nafs. Dr. Morali, and a failure indeed will be he who corrupts it. Means, you know, he has wickedness in it. All that we discuss above. Huh? Clear Quran and doom is the one who corrupts it. You know? So, wow, harfu atafin, kad, kad, the scholars right now here, indeed, for sure, harfu taikik, mabnin ala sukun, khaba, makad khaba, khaba. He failed. Maybe I have to do. No, I won't go do. No, I have to do. I have to go back. Uh, please. I have to go back. Huh? Something comes up. See now, now it, it's clear. Uh, it's clear. Huh? Something crops up, and I will have to go back and come again. So, Chaba, this is Ajwaf Al Jai, like Ba Yabihu, Chaba Yachivu. Chaba Ajwaf Al Jai, he failed, became unsuccessful, became disappointed. He was frustrated. Khaba fielu madin mabnun ala fata. Man, again, same way, same way that we did man. Allazi. Ismun mausunun bimana allazi. Mabnun ala sukun. Fi mahli rafin file. This is the file of khaba. Wa jumlatu. Mautufatun ala jawabu kasam. That we said. Kad Aflahu man zakkaha, that it is motu for Allah, that. Huh? Did you get the idea? Kad aflahu man zakkaha, yeah. So kad khaba man dasaha, opposite of that. Dasa. Huh? What is the meaning of dasa? He corrupted it. He became wicked with all kinds of things that goes in this world. In fact, all around us, people are more or less, I'm very sad to say, they have become immoral. They have become immoral. There is no morality left now. We have to protect us and our children and our family members. How can I protect it? Huh? By learning the Quran. And how can I understand Quran? By learning the language of the Quran. So Alhamdulillah, we are all understanding. When we read the Quran, and we have to read the Quran every day, every day, all the time. Whatever free time we have after our jobs, we got to work hard to bring bread on the table for the family members. After that, any time we have, we must spend in understanding the Quran. And the key to understanding the Quran is the language of the Quran. Alhamdulillah, you are all doing it. I am doing it. And I find happiness that I cannot express myself. I only feel it in my heart. And I thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ya Allah, you have blessed me with this opportunity to understand the Quran, your speech, your miraculous speech directly without translation. Yes, directly. That is, should be our aim, inshallah. And it will happen. I pray for all of you. It will happen. It is already happening to you. You are all understanding it because I talk to so many people and they all love it, you know. Uh, I jokingly tell you about Sister Muluka. She said, Mother Asif, I have become a parvana now. Parvana of what? Quran. <laughs> it means she 
is like a parvana. She reads the Quran and understands it. Always, always she is attached to the Quran. That is parvana. May Allah bless her and bless us all. You know. So kad aflaha wa kad khaba man dasaha dasaha. Dasa means she corrupted. Again the same thing. Form two. Dasa, you does see, but here only dasa. Ha has to be mafulun bi, hopefully. Fialum madin mabnula fata. Where is the fata? I can't see fata. Al mukaddara. So I wrote down here fata. Al mukaddara. See, dasa, if you have to define it, there is a fata here on ya. Dasa ya, but we don't say like that. We say dasa. Litahoth zuri means because of difficulty. We file damirun, mustatirun, jawazan, takdiru huwa, yaudu ala man. Man is the file of dasa. But jumlato, Silatul Mausul, yeah, that's easy. After man, la laji with Silatul Mausul. And then the ha, the saha is your mafulun bihi. I hope you got it, huh? Alhamdulillah. Now, now we come here. <clears throat> Killer Quran gives a heading Destruction of the people of Saleh. Saleh, Rasul Salah, Messenger of Allah Saleh, huh? Alayhim Salam, peace be on him, people of Saleh, Messenger Saleh. Samud, people, the people of Saleh who are called Samud, rejected their prophet, yes, they disobeyed their prophet. Through their inordinate wrongdoing, going beyond normal acceptable limits, they became very corrupt, going beyond normal acceptable limits, crossing the limit. That was Abdullah Yusuf Ali, the people of Samut, rejected their prophet through their inordinate wrongdoings. Yeah. Dr. Morali, they did disbelieve, they did disbelieve the Thamud by their transgression, crossing the limit. Clear Quran, Thamud, the people of Thamud, rejected the truth, yes, out of arrogance, yes. Now this is what we are learning here. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Kazaba. is easy. Form two. Kazaba you kazibu means to disbelieve. To disbelieve. Kazabat. Tau tanisi. Why tau tanisi? Because the file is probably non-Arabic. You can say. Or it is a Thamudu. See, it, it cannot take Tanwin. Huh? That's the reason we have Tau Tanisi here. Kazaba, Fialo Madin, Mabnun Allah Fatah, fine. A Tau Litanisi, yeah, Tau Litanisi. Thamudu, the people of Thamud, that's the file. Marfun Walamadur, Rafi Dhamma. Jumlatu istinafiyatu masukatun lil hadith. Masukatun means to carry on conversation, narrate, remote, lil hadith. Masukatun. We are carrying on the narration of the Samud and Kisatil Samud, yeah, from the story of Samud. Huwa min farikun, it was a party. Allazi dasa nafsahu. They corrupted their nafs. Allazi dasa nafsahu. 
fil kufr, disbelief. Watugiani, tyranny, oppression, high-handedness, that is Tugian. We'll, we'll study more, inshallah. Be tagwaha. So what is the tagwa? Tagwa means here, madi, taga, mudarya, yataga, and then tagwa is a verbal noun. Tagwa is the verbal noun from taga, yataga. Taga, yataga. Taga, yataga. To violate the established norms of justice, to become tyrannical, to go off the mark. Yes, they went off the mark. Here, this is verbal noun, transgression, crossing the limit. Did you get the idea? Inshallah. B, harfchar, this has to be isam majrur, but you cannot take a kasra because of the ya. Albao harfu jarrin. Tagwa ismun majrurun bil ya wa alamatu jarri al kasratul mukaddara. Yeah. So here I put your kasra in a circle to tell you this is just for us to understand. Kasratul mukaddara. Huh? So why? Litazuri for difficulty of putting at the end of ya or wow. But jarun wa majrurun mutalikun bi kazaba. They are all related to kazaba. Well, ha has to be mafulun bi. Yeah, it is ha damirun mutasilun babnullah sukun fi mali nasbin mafulun bi. So even sometimes verbal noun can also make a mafulun bi. So we have our scholars to guide us. Alhamdulillah. Mafulun bi. Ha. Tagwa ha. Ha. Alhamdulillah. Is ambatha ashkaha. Now this is the story, huh? What happened? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tested them. What way did Allah test them? By bringing down a she camel, a very special she camel. Abdullah Yusuf Ali, behold, the most wicked man among them was deput deputed for impiety. Was deputed for impiety. Yeah, this is is ambassador to deputy to send somebody to delegate somebody. Behold, the most wicked man among them was deputed for impiety. Morally, when delegated, was their most wretched one, wretched one, wretched, wretched one, most wicked one, wretched, wretched one. Clear Quran when the most wicked of them was roused to kill the she camel. Huh? Still, the she camel is not come as yet. It will come. Hmm? So, is it's a zarf. Huh? Zarfun. Lima Mada Mina Zamani Mabunala Sukun, yes. There's a sukun there. There is a kasra for some other reason, but there is a sukun there. Kasra is there to join, right? Yeah. Remember Zarf or all Zarfu Zaman means Zamani, this is Zaman. Yeah. They're all Mansu. Mutalikun bifial Kazaba or be Tagwa, and then it becomes mudaf, and is ambasa 
Ashkaha, we'll come to that. Pao bi taqwa wa muda. Fine. Dr. Mori writes very beautifully, was sent out to kill the she-camel. Was sent out to kill the she-camel, which Allah had given as a miracle to the messenger Saleh. Yes, this is it. Morally, very beautifully explained. Was sent out that Ashka to kill the she-camel, which Allah had given as a miracle to the messenger Saleh. No, we have to understand, very beautifully explained. Everything is beautifully explained. And I have highlighted myself with all these things. First, we come to in Baasa. In Baasa. Form five. Remember, when you see in in the beginning, it is most likely form seven. No, did I say five? So, no. Form seven in Basa Yan Baisu. He was delegated. Yeah, that is the meaning of in Basa. Dispatched, sent out. He was provoked, roused. Fialu Madin Mabinala Fata. Very easy. Mabinala Fata. Uhua bi mana habba one dafa. To rush, to proceed. Habba, uh, to proceed. Same meaning. One dafa, also form seven. To proceed. To rush. Now, jumla to mudafili iza. Now, this jumla, my brother, this jumla is the mudafili of iza. Huh? Did you get the idea? Is this whole jumla after is? becomes the mudafil. See, is will all is a zarf, it will have become mudaf, and this is mudafili. The sentence. Jumlatu mudafili is, you know. We got this also. Fine. Ashkaha. Ashka. What is the meaning of ashka? When their most wretched man was delegated, most wretched. Rose, wicked person was delegated. Huh? Ashka ha. Ashka. In Baasa, the fiel Madin, there is the file. Ashka. Ashka is the file. Ashka, the file has to be marfu. File on marfu. Wala matu rafi damatul mukaddara. Same. I, I, I. I'm doing it now in a way that makes it a lot of sense to you, inshallah. I put a Dhamma just for understanding. Remember, just for understanding. Make sure you understand it, it is not written. It's just for us to understand. Dhammatul Mukaddara. Litta Zuri for difficulty. Because you, you cannot put Dhamma so. Uh, it's difficult, so we have to Namatul Mukaddara. But Jumlatum Fi Mahali Jar Mudaf Ilai Baad Iza. I have written here Baad Iza. Ashka here Mudaf Waha Damirun Mutasilun Mabdunala Sukun Fi Mahali Jar Mudaf Ilai. And they have even the name of that person, but we are not going to bother about that, you know. That is good enough for us, inshallah. Alhamdulillah. فَقَالَ لَهُمْ رَسُولُ اللَّهِ نَاكَتَ اللَّهِ بَسُّكِيَاهَا This is very beautiful. Very beautiful, very beautiful. <clears throat> She, there was an agreement between messenger of Allah Saleh and the people of Samud. Huh? 
Abdullah Yusuf Ali. But the messenger of Allah said to them, it is the she camel of Allah. Yeah, that. Nakata Allahi, Nakata is a she camel. It is a she camel of Allah. And obstruct her not, bar her not from having her drink. Don't obstruct her from having her drink, you know. Morally, so the messenger of Allah said to them, the she camel of Allah and her drinking water. Uh, the she camel, she camel of Allah and her drinking water. Have regards for God's camel. This is God's camel and her drinking. Yeah. Sukiya. Uh, Sukiya. Her drinking. Uh, and clear Quran. But the messenger of Allah warned them. The messenger of Allah warned them, do not disturb Allah's camel and her turn to drink. They had made an arrangement. One day, only Allah's camel will drink. The rest, next day, the whole community can go there and have their drink. For Ka'ala, Al-Fahu Atifatun. Ka'ala, we know. Fi'alu madin mabnuna la fata. Lahum, we know lahum. Jarun wa majrur. Jar wa majrur. Hum, damirun, muttasilun, abnun ala sukun, fi mali jar billah. But jarun wa majrurun, mutalikun, bi fiel kaal. Rasul is the prophet. Rasul, failun, marfun, walamatu rafi damma. But jumilatu. لا مهل لها من الإعراب موتوفة على كذبة سمود. It is موتوفة على كذبة سمود. ورسول مودا. Straightforward, you know, very straightforward. And I've done all the signs. When you get the recording, you can understand. Keep a book, make a special book, so that you can write down all the points. I hope you have been doing it. You should do it, inshallah. Huh? Or otherwise, you'll have to buy a computer like this and do it yourself. Rasulullah, Allah, Lafzul Jamal Jalalati, Mudaf ilahi. There is Mudaf, Rasul is Mudaf, Mudaf ilahi. Majrurun, Walamatu Jarri Kasratu. Naqat, She Kamal, Mafulun Bihi, Naqat Allahi. Mansubun balamatu nasbi fatatu li fi'alin mahzufin. Now here it is given another verb here. Li fi'ali, li fi'alin mahzufin. Yadullu ala tahziri, warning, cautioning. I, this is the verb. In zaru, hazira ya zaru. Beware, look out, take care. In zaru, akara nakatillai. Do not wound or injure the camel of Allah. Akara is the wounding, injuring. Nakatillahi. Okay. Tezari also means warning. Nakatillahi. Mudafilei. Lafsul Jalalati. Mudafilei. Majrurun. Walamatu Jarri Kasratu. Now I go to double dictionary. I went to double dictionary. Sukhya, to find out about, more about Sukhya. What is the meaning of Sukhya? Double dictionary, page 442. Saka Yaski. Saka Yaski. Saka Yaski. To give, to drink. To serve a drink. Saka Yaski. Sukhyaha. Vasukya and her drink, and her drink. <clears throat> so, Alvahu Atifatun Sukya, same thing here. 
سکیا اسمون موتفون علا ناکتا منصوبون ولا موتو نسبی الفتا ویریس فتا ویریس فتا المقدرة اگین مقدرة وائے لتعذری فار ڈیفیکلٹی آف پوٹنگ فتا ہے سکیا یا سو آئی دین فتات المقدرة آئی جس پوٹیڈ لائک دائی پوٹیڈ like that. I hope it's very clear. Huh? Nusukya is a verbal noun. Saka huh? yeski, yes. Sukya means drinking water, drink, verbal noun. Vahuwa mudaf ha damirun muttasilun mabdin ala sukun fi malijar mudafini. Fine. So here we have some more expression. I wrote down all of them. Yeah, inshallah, we'll finish it. We'll finish it. <clears throat> Alhamdulillah. So we were here, we did this, further explanation, Rasulullah huwa nabihim saleh, it was their messenger, saleh alayhi salam, Rasulullah huwa huwa nabihim, their nabi saleh, wa now see here, I had to be little careful here. I use my own imagination. I hope I am right. If I explain you, you will understand it, inshallah. See here, sukya is a verbal noun. Sukya is a verbal noun. I wrote down. Verbal noun. Hmm? So now, what will you call it? Sukhya, what is the meaning of? So I wrote down, Shurbu. Why Shurbu? Because this is verbal noun. So we have Shariba, Yashrabu. What is the verbal noun of Shariba, Yashrabu? Shurbu. Sharibtu minal fasli. Li shurbil mai, to have a drinking of water. You remember this sentence we had done long time ago. Kharashtu min al fasli, li shurbil mai. You understand that, I'm sure. So I wrote down here, shurbuha min al mai. Sukhya ha means shurbuha ha is the she camel min al mai. Fala tatarradu laha yom al shurbiha. Yeah. فَلَا تَتَعَرَّدُهَا لَهَا تَتَعَرَّدُ لَهَا يَوْمَ شُرْبِهَا The day of her drinking. تَتَعَرَّدَ From five. So, مُدَارِيَا تَتَعَرَّدُونَ So, فِي اللَّهِ تَتَعَرَّدُ This is لَا نَحِيَا uh, we'll make the fail mudarya mansub la tatarradu instead of tatarraduna we say if la tatarradu laha yawma shurbiha don't interfere with intrude upon don't molest her intrude upon on the day of her drinking did you get the idea alhamdulillah i explained you alhamdulillah Abdullah Yusuf Ali. Then they rejected him as a false prophet. Yeah. <laughs> and they hamstrung her. So their Lord, on account of their crime, obliterated their traces. Yeah, they completely, they were punished in a way nothing was left of them. So I think you all understand, you know. So 
this is I, I also did not know this thing you can learn this from this lesson you can learn this how do they kill camels in the country where they are thriving in the desert people take their meat their their skin for various things and even uh, for she camel the people obtain drink just like cattle you know but there are no cattle in the desert but in the desert allah has given them the ability for camels to thrive so we will learn all this here today inshallah abdullah yusuf ali then they rejected him as a false prophet kazabu yeah and they ham strung her akaruha so their lord on account of their crime obliterated their traces dam dama alayhim dam dama alayhim rabbu the file of dam dama be zanbihim for their crime fasawaha completely destroyed them so now let us understand the meaning of hamstring this is all <clears throat> from dr morally and abdullah yusuf ali both of them mashallah they hamstring her fine we read that but they disbelieved him and hamstring her so they inflicted punishment on them their lord for their sins and leveled them still they defied him and slaughtered her so their lord crushed them for their crime leveling all of them to the ground here yeah. yes it is coming here i was wondering where is that gone you know fine you got some idea huh? now more details will come up come about ham hamstring huh? more detail will come for more detail will come for hamstring hamstring or hamstrung this is verb huh? the hamstrung so <clears throat> we come here pakazabu huh? now we go one by one harf watfin mabni la fata fine kazabu form 2 form 2 kazabu hu kazabu fi'lu ma'din mabnun ala damma why damma vowel jamati file this is becomes a file kazabu kazaba kazaba kazabu vowel jamati file wal jumlatu la mahallaha min al ihrab mawtufatun ala qala lahum rasulullah so this jumla is mawtufun ala qala rahu rasulullah उंडेड <coughs> they wounded her first crippled they crippled her by cutting the tendons at the back of the knee which is called hamstring to you get the idea this is important for us to understand how the camel are slaughtered for for meat or for other purpose but this was a special camel allah warned them not to touch it not to harm it not to molest her you know they wounded crippled by cutting the tendons at the back of the knee which is called hamstring akaru akaru huh? this is akaru is the meaning of that akaru ha this is the camel mafulun bi wow is the file 
figuratively, figuratively, figuratively, figuratively, slaughtered. For they used to hamstrung the camel for slaughtering this way. Slaughtering, figuratively, <coughs> excuse me, figuratively, slaughtered, for they used to hamstrung the camel for slaughtering. Excuse me, yes. <clears throat> Sometimes I, I feel my voice is going, but I'll manage it. <clears throat> So you understood the meaning of hamstrung, huh? you know. Alfau, atifatun, mabdun alafata, akaru, yes. Fieru madin, mabdun aladamma, yes. Vowel jamati, tamirun mutasilun, mabdun alasukun, female irafin file, yes, this is your file. Vajumlatum in fiel wa file, la mahel laha min al irab. Motufatun ala kazabu, yes, kazabu is before. Fakazabu fa akarahu. Fakara. Fakazabu va akaruha. Akaruha motufun ala kazabu. Waha. Damirun mutasilun mabnun ala sukun. Female in asbin mapulun bihi, yes. Alhamdulillah. Fadam dama. Now this is very. Beautiful, my brother. You will love it. You will love this. Dam dama. What is mudaria? You dam demu, like tarjama from Rubai, huh? four letter verb. Dam dama, you dam demu, like tarjama, you tarjemu, like that. Huh? Four letter verb. Dam dama. Alfielu rubai you. Bab. In that also there are bab, fa'alala, dam, dama. In three letter verbs we have fa'ala, but in four letter verbs we have fa'alala, dam, dama. He inflicted punishment, punished, destroyed. Fa dam, dama, fa'u atifatum, dam, dama, fi'aru madin, mabnun ala fata, good. Do you get the idea? This is quadrilateral verb, four letter verb, quadrilateral verb. Huh? Remember that. I've written here, everything is there. You don't have to go and find out. Alayhi him, on them. Allah harfujar, mabdun ala sukun. Hum, damirun mutasilun, mabdun ala sukun, fi malijar, bi ala, jarun wa majrurun, mutalikun, bi fiel, dam dama. Dam Dama. Dam Dama Alehim Rabbu has to be filed. Has to be filed. Rabbu Marfu. Whom has to be Mudafilehi? Rabbu Filon Marfu Malama to Rafi Dama. Yes, that's easy for us. Hum has to be mudafilehi. But jumlatum in fiel wa fail, la mehel la ha min lehra. Motufatum, ala akaru. Akaru, motufatum, ala akaru. Fadam dama alayhim rabbu. Rabbu mudaf. Hum damirun mutasilun mabnun ala sukun. Female jar mudafilehi. Yeah, that's easy. Bizan bihim for their crime. Be harfshar, zanbi isam majroor, wa huwa mudaf, and him mudaf ilayhi. Sometimes they don't write it, but I try to do it, even verbally. If I write, I can write it, but otherwise I say it verbally. You all are expert. I want you to be more expert, more conscientious, 
about all these things, be harfjar. So then B will become isam majroor, wa huwa mudaaf, and him will become mudaafili. Al baow harfujar, babnuna la kasra fight. Then B ismun majroor bil baow alamatu jarri kasra tu. But no, nothing more about that. Wal jarun wa majroor mutalikun fi dam dama. Wa hum Tamirun, Muttasilun, Mabnun Allah, Sukun, Fimalijar, Mudaf Ilai. Where is Mudaf? If this is your Mudaf Ilai, then this is also your Mudaf. I would rather write them Mudaf and then I can say this sentence. Ramuz Jari, Kasratu wa huwa Mudaf. I would rather say for huwa Mudaf. And then I say Jarun wa Majururun, Mutalikun bi Dam Dama. And this is mudafili. But sawaha, yes, sawaha. Okay, form two, sawa, you sawi, sawa. Completely destroyed them. Irrespective of high or low, rich or poor, everyone, no matter they were high or low, rich or poor, they were completely destroyed by Allah Subhanahu wa Taala. Fa, harfuat fin, mabnunala fata, sawa, same here, fielu madin mabnunala fata tul mukaddari, yes, fata tul mukaddari, yeah, I put down there. If if the verb ends with ya or wa, even if a noun ends with wa or ya, we have a fata tul mukaddara. Li tadzuri for difficulty. The file, the mirror, the mustatir, the jawaz, the takdir, who huwa? Who is the huwa? Yaudu ala rabbu, yes. Yaudu ala rabbu, that is the, your, your rabbu is the file of sawaha. Yaudu ala rabbu. Jumlatu, mautufatun ala jumlatu, dam dama rabbuhum. La mahal laha min al-irab. And ha, sabwa ha, this is verb form two, form two, yeah, I'm writing form two. So then this becomes mafulun bi, ha becomes mafulun bi. See now, watch how it is written. Sabwa ha, we cannot, when we put damir with a verb, then we have to change the spelling right like this. We cannot put ya, it changed into alif. So, just remember, smooth, level. Remember this, my brother and sister. Should not confuse you. Huh? That is why all these things are so helpful, so important for us to understand in detail. I am so glad. I am so thankful to Allah that I can understand, I can study, and then I can turn around and explain you, and you study. And this is a beautiful, beautiful evening together. We are here for about one hour and hour and a half, huh? about 90 minutes we are together to enrich ourselves. And remember, every minute of our being in the class has a ajar, huh? has a ajar, Allah will treat it as a ibadat for us, inshallah. Ameen, ya Rabbil Alameen. Did you get the idea? So I got here. No. Where were I? I was here, mafulun bi. Sabwaha, I was here. So here, you call who it is said, dam dama alayhi. I, gadiba. Allah became very angry. But dam dam al kauma they destroyed the kaum. How Allah call me? I tahanahum, crush them, pulverize them, demolish them. Yeah, they were turned into pebbles, destroyed. For ahlaka kum, ahlaka. This is form four. Ahlaka. This is form four. Ahalaka, 
on four mudaria what will be the mudaria you you liku huh? remember i did not write down early so i'm writing it for now what is the meaning of ahlaka ahlaka hum annihilate annihilate destroy completely wiped out they were wiped out huh? crushed same thing demolish pulverized you know fala yakafu ukbaha and abdullah yusuf ali says and for him for allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is no fear of its consequences because he is doing the justice huh? he does everything uh, uh, uh, with justice dr morally and he feared not the consequences of them of thereof consequences of thereof did not fear the consequences of thereof clear quran and he has no fear allah has no fear of his consequences but there are more things here you know one has to think in a way i have written here but i think since all these thing yakhafu the file of yakhafu is allah so we should follow the scholars without thinking of anything else wala okay okay this is wal hal hal kaisa hai janab ka la yakhafu harfu nafyin harfu nafyin abni la sukun yakhafu khafa yakhafu he fears dreads is afraid no abla is not afraid yakhafu fi'lun mudariyun marfu'un wa lamatu rafi damma ala madurafi damma wa fa'il damirun mustatirun jawazan taqdiru huwa that yahudu ala rab yahudu ala rab wa jumlatu min fi'l wa fa'il fi mahli nasbin ha mansub min file sawaha sawaha the file from sawaha that is also rab la yakhafu ukbaha that is it my brother we are coming to an end alhamdulillah alhamdulillah alhamdulillah ukba what is the meaning of ukba ya la yakhafu ukba See again, yakhafu, ukba is mafulun bi, yeah? fiel, mafulun bi, fiel is rab. Huh? Ukba means end, outcome, result, consequences. Ukba is the end, outcome, result, consequences. Mafulun bi, mansubun, walamatuf, nasbi, alfatatur. Mukaddara, yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> it makes me laugh, you know. It comes all the time. We are ready to analyze it. There is a fatatul mukaddara at the end of there. Yeah, litazuri because of the difficulty. Ukbaha has to be mudafili. Ha, tamirun mutasilun yaudu ala dam damati mabniun. Allah sukun fi malijar mudafilehi. So, ukba is mafulun bi. At the same time, it is mudaf. Remember, mudaf because it's a mafulun bi, and mudaf mafulun bi is mudaf, and then ha is mudafili. Did you get the idea? We should have no trouble in. figuring out all these things because this is a noun so it cannot have a fulun bi this itself is a mafulun bi so that will become mudaf and then ha will become mudafili alhamdulillah 
Here is another explanation that was given. So I wrote it down. For none of them, those people of Samud, for none of them had any fear of what might befall them. They did, were not afraid also. They were not afraid. The people of Samud were not afraid. For none of them had any fear of what might befall them. There's another verse also. I did not want to fill it too much. Uh, I had it in my book. And it, it refers to this incident further detail, in more detail. Huh? Well, I didn't want to do this. I just want to concentrate on this. So the, you will find out another, the story of this, inshallah. You will find out. So I will tell you, it is Surah number 7, verse 77. Write down, check it out. Surah number 7, verse number 77. There is more of the story. Huh? Refer. Refer. Refer this also. Huh? This is for your information. You can refer it. Huh? So, for none of them had any fear of what might befall them, implying that their total lack of compassion for God's creatures, yes, we have to be careful, my brothers and sisters. We ourselves have to be careful with all the animals. You know, we should not be cruel to any animals. You know, implying that their total lack of compassion for God's creatures. Showed that they did not fear his retribution and hence did not believe in him. That was the problem. They did not believe in him. They were not afraid of his retribution, punishment. So here I have more. Alukuba. Alukuba. Akharu kulli shayin wa khatimatihi. Kulli shayin wa khatimatihi. And the conclusion, final stage. Akubahu is the final stage. Wa jazau amri. And then the that the reward of the command of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Vamana Fiala Aliyul Kadir. This is a small husna, Aliyul Kadir. Faala Faala Faala Aliyul Kadir means Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did this, did that. Faala Aliyul Kadir. Remember Aliyul Qadir, it refers to Aliyul Qadir, Zalika, be him. So this is what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did with them, be him. Ghaira khaifin, without any fear, min akibatin wa tabiyatin, you know. Akibatin means to end outcome. Tabiyatin means responsibility, consequences. Allah was not worried about anything. Yeah, this is the this is the touching point, final. This is the climax. Why? Lianaha Jazaul Adilu Lianaha the that thing that punishment was Jazaul Adilu reward of justice. Jazaul Adilu Reward of justice, lima fa'alu, for what they did. I hope you can get it, huh? inshallah. I wrote down everything. Alhamdulillah, my brothers and sisters. Jazakumullah khair. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. I thoroughly enjoyed doing all my research and collecting everything. So we end here now and we. Hope to see you next week, inshallah. I haven't decided what I'm going to teach you, but I'll I figure it out and I'll write to you. Let us pray. Please join me in my prayers, our prayers together. 
May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept your sacrifice of time to study and understand the Quran, Arabic language. Huh? Remember, time in Arabic language. As hasanat, yes, I told you hasanat, good deeds. In your scale of good deeds. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you all, your spouses and your children with excellent health, barakats in your risk, in your jobs, in your businesses, in your careers, and in your professions, in your education and the education of your children. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all with strong memory and deep knowledge strong memory and deep knowledge of Arabic to understand in depth the message of the Quran so that we all feel the miracle of the Quran in our hearts. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala enlighten our homes and our families with the light of the Quran and instill this light in our children. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep us all safe and protected from the evil of this virus and all the natural disasters going around us. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect the Muslim Ummah all around the world, wherever they may be residing from the evil of this virus and natural disasters. May Allah protect the humanity at large from the evil of this virus and natural disaster. See you next Sunday, inshallah. Rabbana, atina fi dunya hasanatam, wa fil akhirati hasanatam, wa kina azaban naal. Rabbana, hablana min azwajina, wa zuriyatina, qurrata ayunin, wa ja'alna lil muttakina imama. Rabbana, Takabal minna in Naka and Tassamil Alim, but Tubu Alaina in Naka and Tattawa Burahim, Subhan Arabica Rabbil is at the Amma Yasipuna, with Salamu Alal Mursalin, Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alami. Jazakumullah Hiram. Take care, my brothers and sisters. We'll see you next Sunday. Salamu alaikum, Rahmatullahi, Barakati.